Now, if you, if you know me, you know that I love coffee. I think tea is terrible. Sorry for you tea drinkers out there. But tea also, in this moment, serves as a good object lesson for us. Because when you put tea, a tea bag, into hot water, what is going to happen to the water? It's not a, it's not a trick question. <laughs> What's going to happen, right? The, the water is going to change, right? The, the water will be different. It, look at that. It takes seconds for the water to change, right? And so if we are like this water, Paul is encouraging us to allow the word to dwell in us because we will be changed by the word. Like instantly, everything about the water changes. It has a different taste. It has a different color. Right? We are said to be the aroma of Christ. We are said to take on the likeness of Christ. Paul uses all of these sensory words throughout the New Testament to describe who we are. And the longer, what's going to happen? The longer the tea bag stays in the water, what happens to the water? It gets darker. It gets richer. It gets more potent because the tea bag has dwelt longer in the water. It's the same with us in the Word. The longer the Word dwells, in us, the more and more we change. 